Hey guys, what's going on? It's your girl Chin, back with another video. So everybody's been messaging me on Instagram, asking me to do this video and to let everybody know what my opinion is in the whole Amari in Jamaica situation. Every single day, I'm gonna make something great. That's my way. But I'm going to keep this video short and sweet and get to the point because I remember growing up, my parents always tell me that if you have nothing nice to say, don't say anything at all. So I've searched long and hard for something nice to say. Lord knows I couldn't come up with anything, but I got to give my viewers what they're asking for, right? What do I think about the whole situation? Hmm. I really don't know what to think because at this point, I've given up on even seeing anything come out of this woman's life, to be honest with you. Because for one, what was the reason of her going to Jamaica? There was no reason whatsoever for her to go to Jamaica. I mean, Look at it this way. You left your young kids in America to go to Jamaica to... I wish you could have found. I mean, even know. Because if she's trying to further her career in singing... <laughs> that will never happen. You will never live to see that happen. That's the next story. And I mean, okay, say for example she was going on vacation and she decided that she's going to take her child with her because he's never seen her country and she wants him to see where, what his roots are. That's understandable. Like, I could understand that because I've done that before. I've brought my kids to Jamaica just so they could see where I came from. But you're going to invite your child to Jamaica for the first time and that's what he's walking into? Really? Oh, God. Words does not explain the embarrassment that I felt for that boy. I felt embarrassed for him and I'm not even a part of his family. I mean, being humiliated like that in public, in a foreign country, by the person that is supposed to be your mother, the person that's supposed to be protecting you. How do you all think he felt? Yeah, we all know that she brainwashed her kids and everything, but no amount of brainwash could make up for that sort of embarrassment. And on top of that, I went around with she and man. I saw fear underneath, just a jump. Like, she, one put her out on, uh, the, um, in New York, throw her out on the side of the street in the middle of the night. Tell her I see her underneath, big like Amazon. And now, she ended up back in Jamaica with this other one that she was with how long ago. Like, when is she going to realize that all these men are doing a nyamar out? And she already don't have two penny fist up a steel bread cat. Like, to me, I don't understand. I think that is stemming from low self-esteem. I really believe she has low self-esteem because there's no way that I'm going to have high self-esteem and have people treat me like that. No. I'm not going to allow that because I know what I'm worth. And I know I'm worth way more than how you're treating me. So why does she keep going back and forth 
to these men that treats her so bad? I guess that question will never be answered for us, right? On top of that, you know, I have a lot to say about the Jamaica star. Because it's either that them not have nothing better fit up, are them idle, are there's some sort of a, a comedian vlog because you got to tell me sir, there's so much going on in Jamaica and that's what they're going to interview and put in the front page like Jamaica is not a real place I don't think Jamaica is a real place Jamaica could not be a real place because for one Somebody needs to tell her the truth. She's very good at entertainment. That's for sure. Acting, maybe. But singing, no. No. She needs to give it up. She's never going to make it big in singing because she can't sing. And anybody that's playing her music, they're just doing it as a joke. They have her as a sideshow. Like, it's just for laughs. It don't sound good. Right? It not sound good. And then she's going to say, um, Nico is Gullibop. You don't think you do enough damage by, um, to Gullibop? Why are you going to bring up him name in your foolishness now? Like, leave the man alone now. And this whole arresting, her getting arrested in Jamaica. Let me tell you something. There is a method to this girl's madness. There is a method to her madness. I keep telling you guys that. She knew exactly what she was doing. She wanted to get arrested because she wanted to be in the paper, because she wanted to be on the front page. She wanted to get an interview. And that was the only way for somebody to give her some sort of attention for her to feel like a so-called celebrity was for her to act a fool, get in trouble, and get arrested. That's just my opinion. Let me know what you think about the video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you're new to my channel, Drop a purple heart in the comment section and I'll give you a post notification shout out. See you.